Hey, how's it going everyone? Hope you're all doing well. Uh, yeah, look, I reckon it's high time we had a bit of an update video about what's, you know, what's sort of going on or what's more not going on, more to the point. But, um, but yeah, look, before we get into that, and this old rocket here, uh, I had a couple of you, you know, get in contact with me or whatever on, on the interwebs and that and saying, hey, when are you getting into that Skyline video? You know, getting into it and the project, I should say. Bear with me. I'm hoping to get into it very soon. It's just, you know, family and work commitments and not enough time and, you know, that old chestnut. So trust me when I say I'm really chomping at the bit to uh, get into that project. So it's, uh, uh, oh, we've got quite a few parts and bits and pieces that have showed up. Um, so hopefully we'll, we'll have reasonably soon a couple of Skyline videos. Uh, we'll have a Bouncing Betty HR gasser video. Because uh, hopefully, give me another few more months, we're going to end up buying a, well, that's if I can get the parts if they're available and not having to wait for them as you probably may have figured out it's starting to get pretty hard to get parts and and all the bits and pieces for your projects and even if you're in the trade you know doing this on a daily basis you know automotive trade that is you're probably finding the same thing so but uh yeah look, we're gonna do a little bit of a buying spree of parts that should sort of I guess parts prepping in a way that should uh, see us through to at least the end of this year maybe mid next year with all our projects and uh, you know like stuff like uh, paint for the old Alice Chalmers here and uh, oh, the old you know bits and pieces and you know, all the little things for the HR there and finish buying the parts for the old hey, uh, pardon me our R34 Skyline project so uh, we can keep the content rolling and uh, yeah but, uh, fingers crossed uh, I'd really love to get a video out weekly um, I am working towards that and hopefully that'll get it up on the um, the algorithm a lot more so there's a lot more people viewing it and comes up on your YouTube feed a lot lot sooner and all that sort of stuff but uh, look if you're enjoying all the stuff we've been doing here at Pushrod TV uh, yeah look do the notifications the the notification bell and you know like put, set your notifications for all you know notify all that sort of thing and give us a like a subscribe tell us what you like what you don't like you know uh, tell us what you would, you know, future projects you'd like to see and all that sort of thing. Let's get into a yeah, little Alice Chalmers B model. Alrighty, so uh, yeah, we've got a 1939 B model Alice Chalmers tractor. I think they're roughly around about 20 to 22 horsepower, something like that, at the PDO or the the uh, the belt pulley and around about 18 15 to 18 horsepower at the drawbar we'll be doing plenty of videos on it mainly paint and panel uh got a little bit of mechanical stuff to do on it but um as far as you can see i know it's all filthy and all the rest of it but it's been sitting for this project's been sitting dormant for oh, about 24 25 years uh this was actually the first big major project that I started actually with with my dad so and yeah hey life took over and all the rest of it and it sat in a friend's shed for about 20 yeah like I said 24 25 years so I think it's high time we uh, I reckon I, I get my boys involved so we'll have about three generations that will have uh, worked on this this little Alice Charms so it's, uh, we've got all the panels and all the other bits and pieces uh, sitting in the, our little storage shed just off camera. 
So yeah, it should be a fun project and uh, be really great to see it all finished. Probably don't expect to see much of this project probably until later this year. I'll probably, or oh, I'd reckon I'd probably have to say November, something like that. We'll probably really start to crank up on it. But uh, look, you'll more than likely see it in the background and in other videos and that sort of things. So yeah, look, we'll, we'll go through some of the stuff that we've got planned anyway. But uh, look, we've got a sump and a uh, bit of a windage tray sort of deal there. Uh, ready to modify to put in old Betty here. Once we get that uh, sorted out, then we can finish up all the uh, the steering linkages and all that sort of stuff. So that'll be that'll be mint. Uh, oh, look! If you want to uh, see like a, a few bits of the machinery, like the lathe here being recommissioned, um, serviced, you know, all that sort of thing, I've got to buy a, a new motor for it. Or the, as you probably see in the background here, our CNC plasma table. If you if that's floating your boat, and you want to see those being commissioned and fired up and all the rest of it. Uh, we'll do some videos on those. Uh, also, if, if you want to see a shed tour, well, I mean it's not a very big shed by any means, but um, you know, see what. See what's lurking in the in the two little storage sheds there, and all the rest of it. Hit us up in the comments, and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do a bit of a shed tour and a bit of a toolbox tour, and you know all that sort of thing. I know that was the 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 going fad for a while on uh, a lot of the automotive YouTube channels. So so yeah, um, yeah. Look, we'll. Definitely get into doing a full walk around with uh, our little Alice Chalmers B model. Uh, we'll do the same with Bouncing Betty, which the camera is sitting on at the moment. And, uh, you know, just go through all the work that's been done or needs to be done, all that sort of stuff. And, um, hey, look, we might do it as a live if you're interested. So, hey, like again, chuck down in the comments if, if you want to, you know, do, do a live video. Kick back with a couple of beers and you know, have a bit of a chat. So, and uh, yeah. Anyway, that's it for this video. Not that it was probably overly too interesting, but uh, hey, it is what it is. And fingers crossed, I won't be uh, so time deprived and actually get out here and and have a bit of fun and work on these projects because um yeah look, i'm really enjoying it and i'm really enjoying doing the videos for for you guys and watching them and all that sort of stuff a few likes and all that so it, it all goes a long way anyway what are you waiting for go get your hands dirty i'll see you next video